And good morning, and thanks for choosing 2 News Midday. I'm Justin Wilfon. Aaron Christie is on assignment this morning. New on 2 News in Midday, another important change is coming for Tulsa Public Schools. As the district juggles plans to revamp the schools to save money, the future of art education in Tulsa is in for some changes as well. 2 News reporter Dan Perlman just learned those details and joins us live now with more. Dan? Well, Tulsa now joins the ranks of four other cities na nationwide where the John F. Kennedy Center for the Performing Arts will be leaving its mark in the classroom. The Kennedy Center is partnering with TPS as part of the Any Given Child program. Together, the Kennedy Center staff, community leaders, school leaders, and local arts groups will pool their resources together and develop a long-range art education plan. That means every student, kindergarten through eighth grade, will get the same quality education when it comes to the visual, literacy, and performing arts. With Project Schoolhouse just passed, Ken Busby with the Arts and Humanities Council says the partnership couldn't come at a better time. Because now we'll be able to really focus together at the same time and make sure that as, as the redevelopment happens and as schools are, are put together and, and realigned and all of that, that we will then have a great arts program, which is what the parents have asked for, and we'll be able to be there hand in hand working with you to make sure that this, this really happens. Now, the changes with any given, any given child will slowly evolve over the next year or so. Some changes will start taking place next year, but the full plan will not be implemented until the 2012-2013 school year. Live in Midtown, Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you.